Hello people of the world. We are anonymous. Today we come to you sad and as something far greater and more significant has imposed. Questions regarding the vulnerable generation that will take over ours. We come to you as fathers, mothers, guardians and carers. We see a global wave of torture. Cruelty given by a government-sponsored contract, causing death and destruction in many countries, we understand children can be hard work at times, but that just means they are pushing the boundaries to learn what is acceptable, and what is not. Many countries around the globe suffer at the hands of G4S, and yet nothing is being done about it. No government has stepped in to stop their atrocities. You are being manipulated into silence each day by our current form of affairs, from the family courts, to the adoption system. The education system has many problems that plague our lives, that are not of our making, but are from big corporations and governments, to which many stay silent yet vigilant of these horrors. It is our time to speak up. Now we bring you the most disturbing news about your children yet. We bring you the news that the security company known as G4S now have control of and responsibility for children, this is a government money generator set up in a security firm, idiotic don't you think? giving a security company control over children homes. No longer do social services have control of the developing child's minds, but a cash greedy security firm generating money for government, so your taxes for social services are being wasted, but there is still yet worse to be told. The staff in these security firms are G4S staff, they use pain distraction techniques. Children will be children, but when these children misbehave these are the techniques that one child we know of was murdered, whilst the staff forcibly and painfully restrained crushing his organs, he soiled his pants, vomited, and stated he could end breath, yet they still refused to help him, ladies, gentlemen, mothers, fathers, aunts, uncles, brothers, and sisters of the world, we call on you now to restore order, these staff are using pain techniques often used in torture, that if you or I used, we would be incarcerated, people you are important, and we call on you to highlight what is really happening to the world. Some would say the times we live in are repeating from the beginnings World War II, and how atrocities were carried out behind closed doors. These vulnerable children are you. They will take your place when you are gone. What legacy will you leave behind? The ball is in your court. Would you prefer to see more of the same or will you give a resounding no to G4S having any control over developing vulnerable minds? We hope you stand with us against a security company contracted by the government which is only interested in generating money and manipulating statistics for their next vote and to stay in an extremely well-paid job rather than give positive care and guidance to the vulnerable in our society. We are anonymous. We are legion. We do not forgive. We do not forget. G4S, expect us. Operation. G4S engaged.